Hello students and welcome back to bankexamstudy.com. My name is Ramandeep Singh and today I'm going to provide you five week study plan for SBI CBO 2022 exam. So the exam is going to be held on 4th of December 2022 and you are left with almost five weeks now, right? And today I'm going to discuss the exact plan that you should follow to crack this exam. बहुत ही अच्छा प्लान मैंने बनाया है, along with the study material, the exact study material that you should follow to crack this exam, to cover the entire syllabus. First of all, give a look to the syllabus. Let me hide myself. मैं काफी view खराब कर रहा हूँ. So there is English language, banking knowledge, general awareness and economy, and then computer aptitude. As you can see, for the English language. Uh, 30 questions are there uh, with maximum 30 marks banking knowledge 40 questions 40 marks general awareness and economy 30 questions 30 marks and computer aptitude 20 questions and 20 marks right so uh, let's start with the banking knowledge and general awareness the syllabus of banking knowledge and the general awareness uh, difference देखो उतना नहीं है right as we you know teach for IBPS RRB GBO scale two the syllabus is quite similar to that right uh, but there is a fine difference that's what we are going to discuss right the general awareness and economy it's more about current affairs the static GA the banking knowledge is more about RBI circulars RBI guidelines some of the laws जैसे कि uh, Surfacy Act, IBC, Negotiable Instruments, Banking Regulation Act. We are going to cover that, the banking products, all the news that is related to banking, like basal norms, priority sector lending, all those topics we are going to cover in the banking knowledge, right? So how we are uh, going to plan? And one important thing, there is no negative marking. So I recommend everybody... Uh, when you go to the exam, attempt all the questions and a special thing, there is a descriptive paper. Within 30 minutes, you need to write an essay and you need to write a letter as well. It's important. And uh, if your speed uh, is slow, if your typing speed is slow, it would be very difficult for you to crack this exam. Aapke liye actually, it will be very difficult to crack this exam. I mean, if you are, uh, you know, if your typing speed is slow, then how will you do it? No, it will not be able right? So, practice is required. You need to practice on screen. You need to practice on a keyboard. If you practice on the keyboard, then you will not be able to speed. So, you will not be able to do the exam crack. Right? So, the plan goes like, in the very first week, I recommend you to go through Banking and Financial Awareness Digest prepared by the team bank exams today. Usme sara banking ka knowledge hai. Everything happens in the banking industry. All the news related to banking industry. Any appointment in the banking industry. Any MOU. Uh, any loan agreement by an international organization. Everything is covered in the Banking and Financial Awareness Digest. You need to cover that. RBI circulars are very important. For last 12 months, uh, every month I do a session of like 20 minutes. So 20 minutes multiplied by 12, you can easily cover that within 2-3 hours. Easily cover that for last one year. And trust me, once you cover all the RBI circulars, you'll get immense knowledge. You will get knowledge aapko, right? And that would help you in interviews as well. That would help you in the general awareness section as well, in the banking and economy section as well. Very important. Hai. English is an important section and if reading online is not a habit, if you don't have a habit online reading, karna, then this exam would be very difficult for you. If you want to crack the exam, you need to read online, right? Read online, news articles, whatever you like, whatever you love, just read it. And you need to practice reading comprehension sets. If you are not doing that, that would be very difficult for you, right? So practice it. Very important for you. Okay. In the second week, we are going to provide SBI CBO 2022 power capsule. So all the topics from the general awareness and even from the banking and economy, we are going to make a single capsule. That would be around 170, 180 pages of content and we are going to provide that to all our students, right? All the appointments, everything related to the current banking news. We are going to cover that and we are going to make a question bank out of it. 
So whatever we are teaching, uh, whatever we have written, we'll make question bank out of it. You need to go through that and that would be important and continue reading the news articles in the second week. Usko continue kare aap, okay? In the third week, continue reading power capsule and question bank as you would uh, imagine ki yaar, why you are giving so much emphasis to the power capsule and question bank. Students, what, whatever, whatever the research that we have done, what we are going to do is we are going to convert that into tables. We are going to convert that into tables, clickable links. It would be, it would take time to read it, to revise it. So that is why I'm asking you to give at least eight, nine, 10 days to just power capsule and question bank. We are doing all the hard work for you. You just need to read that. Just tell me how, how's it? Okay. And it is very useful. It would be very useful. We are doing this for RRB GBO, we did that. For Bank of India Credit Officer, we did that. And that really went very good. There are many questions in that. And you need to read the basic computer notes from the course that we are providing and continue reading news articles. And now you need to, you have, uh, you know, gone through the news articles. You news articles. Now you need to practice error spotting questions. And if you are doing well, you are, you know, getting 70-80% questions correct. Move forward, aage badhiye, nahi to, you have to practice, you need to read the grammar notes. You need to go through the grammar videos. That is important. And then in the week four, the acts, IBC act, which is actually very important, Surface act, ratio analysis and cost of capital, even the cash flow statement, uh, very easy topic. Uh, you are supposed to do that as well. Negotiable Instruments Act, Government Schemes, how to write an essay, how to write a letter because descriptive paper is actually very important. Likhte kaise hai? You need to know the format. Format is everything. If you don't know the format, even if you are writing really well, phir bhi baad nahi ban you, you need to write it in a proper format. You should know uh, flow kaise hota ideas ka. There should be a proper flow of ideas. It should be concise. Very important. Then, write at least 10 essays and 10 letters. Even if you are doing it in week four and then you are taking some days from week five, you have to do that. Otherwise, if you are not practicing the, uh, you know, uh, proper essay writing or letter writing on a screen, on a keyboard, you won't be able to write a proper essay at the time of exam. You won't be able to write a proper essay at the time of exam. Because within 30 minutes, I guess it, it, they gave you 30 minutes. Within 30 minutes, you need to plan it. You need to write it, right? And you need to check it as well for the errors. You need to write according to the format. If you don't even know the format, how would you write? It won't be possible for you to write, right? So the fact is within 30 minutes, you need to read the question. Whatever the question is, you need to make a mind map. Okay, these are the topics I'm going to write. That's how uh, I'm going to write. Write it and you need to cross check it, right? What are the my mistakes? Correct it. I'm going to make a video on how to write an essay for SBI CBO on Monday. Watch that session. That would be very useful to you. Okay. And then in the week five, you need to take mock test. Um, if you are not taking any mock test, you won't be able to crack the exam. That it is not possible at all. You can't do that. Mock tests are actually very, very, very important, right? And then you need to revise the SBI CBO power capsule, right? Just revise it. That would be very useful study material that you're going to get. Just revise that. And how uh, you're going to get all that study material, all the videos, all the research that I'm talking about, you're going to get it on bankexamstoday.com, SBI CBO 2022 course, the power capsule, question bank, test series, video classes, live sessions, everything is part of the course. <clears throat> the systematic study plan is part of the course. You can WhatsApp me, <coughs> sorry, 9067201000. This is my personal WhatsApp number. Ask your doubts or you can directly join the course. Links are in the description. Join the course from the link available in the description. Up directly link pe jai or course ko join ki jiye. Use the coupon code GURU. This is the co code that you can join, uh, that you can use. Hai? <clears throat> uh, list of our successful students in the past, uh, in the RRB scale 2 and scale 3 in 2021 and 2020. All these students that took our courses in the past and they cracked their respective exams. I'm really, really happy for them. 
if there is any doubt in your mind please ask your doubts and we are going to answer your doubts on whatsapp and you can ask your doubt on the comment section i'm going to answer you that's actually all for today students i hope you like this session i hope you like this plan uh doable achievable this is a golden opportunity i would say so many vacancies 1400 plus vacancies but the eligibility criteria is very strict golden opportunity just do it i'm with you if there is any doubt drop me a whatsapp message i'm going to answer all your doubts that's actually all for today students thank you and have a very nice day bye bye